All right, welcome back. So this time the audio got corrupted, so I'm doing a voiceover instead. Uh, here I'm going to show you how to fix the annoying green LED of these FIDO security keys that you can get from all kinds of places. Uh, they're all uh, very similar, but they're produced by the same Chinese company called Feitian, and they're very nice because they're very small. Uh, very similar to the YubiKey Nano that you can get for 50 US dollars, which is way more expensive. And although this one is a tiny bit bigger than the Nano, it's still very suitable for a permanent installation that I needed, except for that green LED. To remove that green LED, you'll need a tiny screwdriver like this, or a knife would do as well. So everything is held in place by these two retainers on each side of that USB slot. So you just press on those retainers on both sides of that USB case and slide that inner part out. So as if it was plugged into the computer, you would slide that inner part out of that element. It should come out easily. If it doesn't, then just try playing some more with it and uh, everything should just slide out like that. And then you're left with three parts. The metal case for that USB uh, the white one, just a wrapper around that, and then the green one that has the PCB on it. So the PCB is glued onto the green part, but it comes off very easily. And once you've done that, you can see that switch uh, on one side of the PCB, and then the LED that you just take with the squeezes and twist it like that. And that removes it from the PCB. Putting it together is very easy. Uh, you just follow the kind of the the same steps uh, backwards. Everything fits into place and there's pretty much like one way to put it together. The PCB should be put on top of that green part with the large USB pads facing towards you so that you can at that point kind of try and use that switch. And the holes in the middle part should be facing the same direction as the four gold plated pads on the PCB. That way it slides back nicely together like it was before and the retainer is fixed in place and you get this nice little security token but without the green LED. And now you can leave the device plugged into your computer the whole time without worrying about finding that keychain every time you need to re-authenticate with Google or GitHub. So thanks for watching the video and don't forget to subscribe.